Hey Divas, so in today's video, I'm here to share with you guys my March favorites. So if you guys are interested, then go ahead and stay tuned. Okay Divas, so I know before we start this video, I just wanted to address something. I know I haven't done a favorites video in like quite a while now. And it's just because I've been trying so many different things and... I just feel like I don't have the time to like really stop and focus on a product but luckily I have a few products that I have been able to focus on so one I wanted to start off with is a product that I was sent so I was sent a wedding shoe survival kit and it is by Zumi so this is basically a wedding survival kit and it comes with balfa cushions heel cushions heel grips mini gel dots and a carrying pouch so this is what the carrying pouch looks like and I have worn all of these. I've had these for actually quite a while and I wanted to make sure that I was going to give you guys like my honest opinion on them since they were sent to me. So um, yeah, I've been wearing them and this is actually a new one because I didn't want to come on and show you guys uh, like the ones that I wore even though they're not dirty. It's just weird. I don't know. I feel weird about it. But anyways. So I've tried all of them. So these are my absolute favorites because I feel like it gives like comfort to like where the arch of my foot is because my feet are like, like they're kind of flat. So this really, really gives that comfort. The mini gel dots. Um, I didn't, I wasn't really like sure how to really use them. So I don't know I didn't really use these just to be completely honest so I don't know about those I also did use these and these are actually my favorites like I bought something similar um from the drugstore before but they were like way more expensive but I really really do like these and I also like the heel grips as well because they were super duper comfortable and for those shoes like I don't know why some of my heels like they just like really irritate my freaking heels like the heel of my feet so I just really found that these came in handy and I will definitely um be using these in the future for my heels and everything I always think that it's good that you can have like something to make your heels feel comfortable because you guys know our dogs be barking you know pretty soon if you don't make those heels comfortable but yeah I will leave a link in the description box below in case you guys want to check out zoomies for their wedding shoe survival kit and you do not have to be getting married um for you to use this wedding shoe survival kit or if you are going to a wedding and you want to wear um like heels for a special event you might want to get these but like I said before it is just called a wedding shoe survival kit but you do not have to be getting married because is we're definitely not to my wedding yet so and I use them so definitely check this out I will leave a link in the description box below so yeah check that out guys okay so now we're just gonna go ahead and move on to skincare so if you guys are following me on snapchat that you guys have already seen these products and you are probably waiting on the update and if you are not following me on snapchat then why are you not following me on snapchat I will annotate it right here it is at glam Shay. so be sure to go ahead and follow me because I do show some products and everything like that before I post it onto YouTube so anyways the products that I'm talking about that I did displayed on snapchat before i got to bring them to youtube is the shea moisture um skincare products so the first one that i really wanted to try was this clarifying mud mask and this is the um african black soap one i also got their problem skin moisturizer and this is also from the same line so as you guys can see it's the same color it's the same line and then i also got their facial wash and scrub and then i also picked up their problem skin toner so these products worked pretty good so i thought at first so when i first started using them i did initially like them but i noticed that i started breaking out really bad in the center of my face so maybe the problem was because the products were the soap was really drying out my skin because I could feel it drawing my oils like when I'm using it and also the balls uh or the yeah there's like balls in here because this is a scrub they are way too abrasive for my skin um and I've never had a problem with that so that was really really strange to me but these are just too abrasive it dries out my skin too much and you guys know like in my t-zone area I am very very oily but this just like this caused me to break out 
and it dried my skin out and yeah i mean and it doesn't mean that it's not gonna work for somebody else it just did not work for me like i think a lot of people have to understand that we all have different skin but i did want to share my experience with you guys on this facial wash and it did not work out for me so i just wanted to make sure i let you guys know that however the mask did work out for me like it it really brought that hydration back into my skin um i had to find myself using this like almost every day yeah every day especially when i used this soap because it would just draw all of my oils and yes i'm oily and i want to get rid of some of the oiliness but drawing out all of my oils just causes my skin to be problematic and produce more oil and that's just my skin personally and when my skin produces more oil it just produces like little tiny bumps and it makes my skin just bad but anyways this was restoring my hydration to my face um and i also was really really loving the toner as well along with the moisturizer but however um i like to if i'm going to use things like this i like to use them all together and since i can't use the scrub then i'm probably just going to have to dump the rest of the products because i do want to use them you know together so i probably will have to revert back to the other products that i've been using because i'm finding that now that i'm getting older like my skin and everything is changing so i can't just use like anything like i was able to before so yeah i'm probably gonna have to dump those even though i will i will say and i will testify that these work great but this scrub was like no ma'am for this like this is a, it's a no for me but the rest of these products are pretty good okay so i have another skincare product to share with you guys so this is the pure body naturals anti-acne serum and pore minimizer i've been absolutely loving this you guys and i also shared this on snapchat i was actually sent this by pure, pure body naturals and i absolutely love this this is my second bottle like i really really stand by it like it works absolutely amazing and it's been really helping me since i had those um blemishes on my skin and it's really been helping to minimize my pores as well as calm down and reduce the texture that that breakout had caused on my face so i really really stand by this i will leave a link in the description box below in case you guys are interested and like this is one of my favorite products that i received no shades to anybody else but this is like really really amazing like this is magic in a bottle so definitely check it out you guys so i've also been loving this maybelline instant asian wine primer like this stuff works absolutely amazing and it also helps to like smooth out my imperfection like this is like a filter in a bottle and it's super duper affordable so i've been really really loving this primer it's been my favorite so we're gonna move on to something that's not so much skincare but i wanted to share it with you guys in case you struggle with the same struggles that i do so i wanted to share with you guys the sally hansen spray on shower off so i am super duper afraid of shaving and it's because like i have cut myself like i've had instances when i ran out of nair or when nair just stopped working for me because my hairs have grown back like i don't know if they grown back super strong or what happened but the nair just stopped working at some point so i had to stop using that and i started shaving and i would just cut myself so i was looking for a product that i could use that would not will be painless and I was at the drugstore and I saw this a couple months back and it works pretty good. So, you know, if you struggle with that, you know, werewolf hair on your legs like I do, then definitely check this out. I will say that you do have to use it twice. Like you have to do this twice if your hairs are strong because it will not work because I have to use it twice. But hopefully you don't have hair like that on your legs. But definitely check this out because this does really work. So moving right along, I found this little fragrance. And this is called Taboo Rose. And I found this at Rite Aid. I absolutely am obsessed with Rite Aid. Like, I don't think I could live my life in a week without going to Rite Aid at least once or twice a week. And I saw this in Rite Aid. And I was just like, hmm, I like the packaging because do you guys see how cute this is? It's just rose gold. Like even if I was just going to put it to sit it on my vanity or on my bookshelf where I have all my perfumes and everything, I was like, I'm going to get that. But I decided to go ahead and try it and it smells absolutely amazing. I want to tell you guys how it smells. Like it smells really, really like nice and duh like it smells nice okay so it smells like very like a very nice soft perfume 
with a hint of rose and it's like kind of tropical and fruity so i do like tropical and fruity smells i don't like rose that's why I like the smell of roses on its own no i do not like that that's why i kind of thought that this was just going to be like an item that i would sit on my vanity but it actually smells pretty good this bottle on sale was only five dollars it's normally like 11.99 and the big bottle is only 60 dollars so i think that that's really really good because you know perfumes that you normally like typically range from like a hundred dollars and up so I would definitely say to try this out I don't know if they still have it at Rite Aid or if they were just having it at that moment but definitely check it out um like on Amazon or something I will try to find a link and leave in the description box below but if not it's called Taboo Rose okay so moving on to hair products um I'm moving on to edge control and it is the 24 hour edge tamer extra firm hold I absolutely love this this lays the edges like no other and I just really really love it I would definitely recommend and urge you to try it you should be able to find it in your local beauty supply i'm not gonna leave a link down in the description box below just being honest just go look at your beauty supply but this stuff is really really nice you guys know i have a werewolf hairline and my hair is pretty strong and i'm natural so if it works on me it will definitely work for you if you have like a softer texture of hair or even if you have a rough texture of hair like me or it should work because everything does not work for everybody i hope it works for you but if it don't do not come for me okay but last and certainly not least i have my last two items and they are both lippy items so the first one i want to start off with is this lip palette i actually got this a while ago when it first came out and i'm so sad that i did not get to do like a swatch video with you guys i know i already owe you guys a swatch video which i'm trying to i'm gonna try to get that done today but anyways this is the elf palette in collaboration with itty's Belen, and this is her mis amores lip palette and i absolutely love this palette this is like a good everyday palette for pretty much all seasons except for this purple color um, I wouldn't wear that in all seasons, but it's definitely the season for it now, maybe like spring and summer, but I absolutely love it. It also comes with a mirror and it also comes with a makeup bag. It's somewhere, but that makeup bag is awesome because it has like compartments and it allows you to like separate things that you need to separate. And yeah, I thought that that was pretty amazing. The lip, um, the lip glosses, because this is not a matte lip palette, the lip glosses are absolutely amazing. They're perfect for every day and i just really really love them and i would definitely check them out they are super duper affordable you can find them at elf.com i don't know if they have them in stores yet i don't remember i don't think i watched her snapchat again after she made the update but i do love it is villain but i am not giving you guys like a biased opinion like i really do love it if i didn't love it like i'll tell you it was garbage like if that's what it was but this is a really nice lip palette especially for the everyday woman and even if you're not the everyday woman if you just need an everyday lip color you can definitely find it in this lip palette and if you need something you know to go to the night too like you can find it in this lip palette so definitely think that this lip palette is a winner so the last item that I want to share with you guys is the Brilliant Effects Lip Gloss by Black Radiance. This one is in Lovesick. I absolutely love this. Um, you guys probably have heard that in my other videos. But yeah, I really, really love this. I've bought backups. Like, this lip gloss is a must-have. I would definitely, definitely recommend it. And it's super duper affordable, especially if you can get it at, like, your local Rite Aids or your drugstores because they're always having an amazing sale. Or you could just wait till they're having a sale because sometimes you could buy one, get one. Or they go down to as low as, like, $2 or, or something like that. So, yeah, I would definitely recommend this as well. Okay, Diva, so that is pretty much my favorites. I know it probably wasn't much to some of you guys, but that is basically my favorites. Be sure to go ahead and check out the links I have in the description box below in case you guys are interested in any of the items that I showed that I told you guys that I was going to link. So yeah, be sure to go ahead and check that for all the information. And I want to just thank you, Diva, so, so much for watching. Like, I super duper greatly appreciate it. Super duper greatly. I really appreciate you guys. Like, I can't even find the words to tell you guys how much. I appreciate you guys for watching and everything. But yeah, if you guys did enjoy this video and find it helpful, then go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Be sure to go ahead and leave me a comment down below. I would love to communicate with you lovely divas. And be sure to go ahead and subscribe if you haven't done so already. And um, yeah, hit the notification bell so you will not miss any videos from me. I do upload three times or more a week, so you definitely don't want to miss that. But yeah, divas, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I greatly appreciate it. And I will see you lovely divas in my next video. Bye.